All right, Youth Zone, we've got Philip Afia with us today. Uh, Phil, how was, uh, how was practice today, man? Uh, practice was good. We had a couple of new installs, so there was a lot of teach tempo stuff to start it off and then just trying to get used to the lineups and new things that we got to do. Now, so this is now your third fall camp, second or third? Uh, it is my third one. Third, man, time flies, huh? It definitely does. And, and how, much, how much more comfortable do you feel in the defense and, and just your game overall? I feel the highest level of comfort you can be, like from where I was before. It's been a good year. Like, I started off in spring getting a lot more reps, starting to feel comfortable with knowledge of the defense, so I'm not thinking about my job. I just know what to do, and I can help other people with their assignments. And that's been the biggest thing that, that a lot of people have noticed is just it's just reacting with you. And, and I guess, what comes with that? Is that just reps? Is that studying? I mean, what what entails, what brings that comfort, That just that reaction? Uh, for me, it's reps. Like, I, I'm like, I'm more of like a physical learner. I have to be out there to do the stuff, and I learn it quicker. So the more times I do it out on the field with my teammates, the easier it is. And then once you get your confidence level up, it's, it's way easier to get work done. Awesome. And so you've been working with with Coach Scally now for a couple years. And, and just how is your relationship with him? How is he now that with the, the safety group and just kind of just your relationship with him? It's a good relationship with him because he's honestly the smartest person I know. So everything he says, like at first, like, it would be hard for me to like get used to it or try to do everything right, but everything it puts you in the right situation. So, like I have a lot of respect for him more than like anybody else. Smartest guy just helps us get lined up, do everything right, teach us the right way to do things, and just make sure we make no, or take no shortcuts. Awesome. So, this is your your third fall camp, like we mentioned, and, and that means you're kind of like the elder statesman in the group. And mm -hmm. what does that mean to you? Are you taking on kind of that leadership role? Are you being vocal with the guys and, and kind of helping them as as much as you can, or what? Yeah, no, I definitely am. I'm taking like I take all the younger guys that are new to this under my wing and try to teach them all the stuff like in terms that they might understand. Just things I'll slowly get them integrated into it like easier so definitely I've been like trying to take a leadership role and help people out make awesome. sure everyone's on the same page awesome so there are a lot of new guys uh, who's who's been standing out the most to you on defense we'll talk on defense new guys on defense right here Jalen hey. Jalen's the biggest standout for me right now out of the new guys I love how he came in came in ready to play good size athletic yeah instantly making plays with us I know he's gonna be a good a great like addition to the team yeah, he's sure, coming first, in. Right off the bat, he's going to definitely help us win our championship. Awesome. That's good to hear. And then let's talk the offense. It's a new offense, a lot of new players, new faces. Um, what's What's been the biggest difference competing against this offense compared to the ones previously? Um, I think the biggest difference with this offense is the different route combinations they do. It's like the whole new scheme you got to learn and the tempo. The tempo they run it at, you, like they run their offense, you have to always be, you have to be in the best shape. You can't stop like to think about things. You just have to know exactly what's coming and see the personnel. Otherwise, you're in, you're going to be lost out there. Very cool. Now, now, real quick. I mean, definitely appreciate the time. Just, do you have goals that you're setting for your for yourself this upcoming season? For this season, uh, for me, honestly, my goals were become more of a leader to the team, get at least four interceptions, and just earn my starting role and keep it. Make sure I make plays and help on special teams. Definitely. Cause that's that's a core thing we have here. So, very cool. Yeah, very cool, man. Taking it serious. Yeah, very cool. Well, we definitely appreciate the time, Phil. Best of luck to you this season, and thanks for thanks for joining us. All right, thank you.